there's something I want to show you. What? Dinosaurs! That's right. We have some dinosaurs trapped in ice. Oh, no! But I have a special way to get them out. Oh, let's see, let's see. So under these cups, there are dinosaurs trapped in ice. Come on out, dinosaurs. Come on out. I have hot water right here, and I'm going to try to melt the ice using these droppers. Well, that doesn't sound too difficult. Well, the only thing is, Fizzy. Yeah, what is it? I need to avoid that guy. Whoa! Oh, oh. Good luck, Miss Hands! Ah! Whoa, dragon. Be a good dragon. I'm going to load my dropper up with water and start dripping it on the ice. I think it's starting to work. No, don't go near the dragon. Ah, ah. I see some little dinosaur feet. Ah, Ooh, that's some cold ice. Let me keep pouring this on there and save our dinosaurs. If we can just get this ice to crack all the way around, we can get everyone out. Almost there. Come on ice, come on ice, crack. Ooh, I have a cold hand. Oh no. Please be good, no, no, please be good. I almost have the dinosaurs out, no. There's ice around their necks. I need to, ah, help them. You behave back there. Let me melt away this ice right here. And I think to finally set them free, I'm gonna dump a bunch of hot water on the ice. And now, break them free. Okay, I'm putting away my blue dropper. Hey, that matches the, whoa, blue ice. And I'm going to get out. A T-Rex! Oh, maybe he likes the T-Rex. Whoa, the yellow ice just dropped. Here we go, another T-Rex. This one, this one is orange. And our last dinosaur is out. But we still have two more chunks of ice. And one cranky <laughs> dragon. I'll use the green dropper on the green ice. I'm gonna work really quickly and try to get all of these dinosaurs out of the ice. Looks like we need more water. More water. They're almost out. We got out this pterodactyl. Yes, we got out another dinosaur. Little dinosaur, you are free. I'll use the yellow dropper on the yellow ice. Okay, time for lots of water on this ice. I see little dinosaur feet. Come on out, little dinosaur. Come on out. You're free. And we got another dinosaur out. Last dinosaur, you're out of there. Woohoo! Way to save all the dinosaurs, Miss Hands. Let's take a close look at them. Paleontologist? What's that? 
It's a special kind of scientist who studies life on Earth through fossils and, well, dinosaur eggs. Ooh, that's cool. Let's keep looking for eggs. Okay, eggs, where are you? Where are you? Whoa, that's not an egg, that's a dog. And what's this over here? What? What? That's not an egg. That's a lifeguard. Um, excuse me, can I help you? Yes, maybe you can. Have you seen any dinosaur eggs? No, no dinosaur eggs. I don't think they actually exist. Oh, they do. And there's a dinosaur mama, and she's really sad that she lost her eggs. Hello? Hello? Has anyone, Has anyone seen, seen dinosaur, dinosaur eggs, eggs around, around the pool? The pool. The pool. No? no? Okay. okay. I, didn't, I think didn't think so. Yeah, no dinosaur eggs around here. Do you happen to have another pool around here? Yeah, the baby pool. It's over there to the left. <gasps> Great! Thank you! Let's go, Phoebe! Let's go! It looks like this cute little doggy has found something. Or there's the baby pool, but it's just covered in sand. Let me have a closer look. There's sand, and then... <gasps> Do you see what I see? Busy! It's dino eggs! Yes, it is! This ants! Let's get those dino eggs! Good girl! Way to find the dino eggs! Let's go ahead and brush some of the sand off of this egg. <gasps> it is a dinosaur egg! There's one. Gotta dig under all this sand. Two... Oh, 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 here's another one. Three. And is there one more under here? Yes, that's four dinosaur eggs. All right, we have all these eggs. Let's take them back to the dinosaur mama. She's just happy we found her eggs. Oh, wait. She's trying to tell me something. Oh, she's a little worried that the eggs have not hatched yet. And she wants us to help her. Okay, Busy, but I'm not sure how I can hatch a dinosaur egg. Oh, you may need a little Fizzy magic. Fizzy, Fizzy Wizzy, Bubba Zee, Bob. Oh, cool. Thank you, Fizzy. So Fizzy gave us some tools to crack into these dino eggs. Let's try to find a little crevice right here, and we'll just hammer into the eggs. We're getting somewhere with these little tools. I'm being very careful. Don't worry, Mama. I'm being careful. I won't hurt your dino babies. We have a hole. Can we see anyone yet? No, not yet. I can see why the babies are having a hard time hatching out of their eggs. These eggs are very hard to get into. Sorry, Mama, I'm working as fast as I can. Oh, she's trying to tell you something. She said, put them in water. Uh, put them in water? Oh, I can help. Fizzy, Fizzy Wizzy, Wizzy Bubba, 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 Wow, thanks, Fizzy. <gasps> she laid them in a pool because she knew they needed water. What a smart dinosaur, Mama. So the water is going to make this egg softer. And it'll be easier for me and the dino babies to crack this egg. I hear something. I think the dinosaur baby's trying to come out. Come on, little dino baby. I'm going to help you. I can't see anything yet, but we're almost to the dinosaur. <gasps> Look, I see a little tail and little legs. I'm going to be very careful. Don't worry, dino mama. I almost got your baby. <gasps> Here comes your dinosaur baby. <gasps> okay, we need to rinse it off a little bit and see what kind of dinosaur this is. Here's our baby dinosaur. It's an Ankylosaurus. And here's a picture of an Ankylosaurus. This dinosaur was covered in thick bony plates that help keep it safe from other dinosaurs. Even though it was super tough, Ankylosaurus ate only plants. Rawr! Okay, we're going to put this little baby with Mama. Mama! This is the most amazing thing I have ever seen. Let's find more dinosaur babies. We need to get to work because we have three more eggs and three more babies to find. Let's let this little egg sit in the water. We'll put the other ones in here and they can just wait until it's their turn to hatch. Okay, and while we wait for these eggs to soak for a little bit, I have a big surprise for you. I have my very own dragon. There she is. This is Trixie. She has a lot in common with dinosaurs, but she's not a dinosaur. 
She's a type of reptile called a bearded dragon. She has scales just like dinosaurs. She even has these sharp pokey ones for protection. She has long claws like a dinosaur. She eats plants just like the ankylosaurus, but she also eats bugs too. She loves worms and roaches. Okay, let's crack into those eggs, Trixie. It's so much easier to crack into these, whoa, when they've been in the water. And hey, I see a little dinosaur head. Come here, little dinosaur baby. Wow, here's one little dinosaur baby. Let's find out what it is. We have an Elasmosaurus. Look at the long neck and this little tail. Let's find out more about it. Yes, Mama, I'm giving you your baby, don't worry. Elasmosaurus, look at that neck. It's a giant marine reptile that uses its flippers and tail to swim the seas during the age of the dinosaurs. Its long neck let it sneak up on other animals and take a bite without having to go too close. Plus, the Elasmosaurus used its long, thin teeth to trap fish. <laughs> Okay, Mama, yes, I know, I know. You're eager to see your little babies. So we're going to dig right in to this next egg and find the next little baby. Whoa, I see a red baby in here. Look, let's get this baby out. Come on, little baby, don't be scared. We're gonna clean you up. This little red dinosaur is a Cyconia. Look at all those spikes on it. Okay, Mama, here comes your baby. Here's a Cyconia. The Cyconia have complex nasal tubes. That means their nose and secondary ridges of bone, indicating they lived in a hot, humid environment. They have salt glands behind their nostrils, so that would be right behind here, allowing them to breathe moist air when they are in a dry environment. So cool. <laughs> Yes, Mama, I know, I know. You're ready to get to your last little baby here. So let's find your last baby. Will it be a T-Rex, a Triceratops? We'll have to wait and see. I see a tail right here. Okay, I'm going to gently dig around our little baby dinosaur and get this one out. This one has a very long neck. Whoa, do you know what kind of dinosaur this is? Let's go clean it up. This little green dinosaur is a Diplodocus. Long neck and a long tail. Okay, Mama, here you go. Here's a Diplodocus. They have such long tails. Look, and the neck is as long as the tail. The Diplodocus has a huge body shape long neck and tail, and strong limbs. That means these legs are very strong. It was considered the longest dinosaur many years ago. Its size is sufficient to deter predators such as Allosaurus and horned dragons. So that means because it's so big, it scared away other dinosaurs. All right, Mama, are you happy? <laughs> about dinosaurs. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and we hope you have a fizzy fantastic day.